all right so what is going on youtube i just did a couple of mistakes while i was trying to play this deck and it just it's just horrible hopefully i can correct myself but yeah this is the deck i did make a couple of changes i added the tozokin little combo with draco request because you cannot you can put it off in this deck so we're definitely going to try it thanks for the suggestion from my guest i think i, I believe it's billy wimp uh, i i'm i'm pretty sure it's him that he left a comment and he was talking about how he played against a guy who did the combo and it was pretty broken so uh not broken but broken so that's what we're going to do today we're going to try that out so yeah that's pretty much all we changed um i took out these three because you really don't need the second deadly guy you never really use it um you, i never went into this and it just you need it to be on the field it's it's, it's kind of horrible and brio um like i said you can interchange it with Nos nosferatu or dragulus it's really up to you i just i haven't really got too many i never got to play this card so not never got to play it but i, I don't really use it that much so i just want to test it to see how good it is but like i said it's always interchangeable with brio because you know i mean they're just interchangeable so <laughs> that is it for the little deck profile the little mini before the game thing and uh yeah so without further ado um if you guys do enjoy this video leave a like leave a comment and also subscribe if you have not already um and also if you guys can click an ad to help support the channel that would be very helpful and i thank you for it so without further ado let's just hop into these duels and hopefully i don't fuck up again all right so here we go against the bread box tv and we have lost the rock paper scissors and we are going second and we'll open up pretty fucking good why are you saying it's pretty good we have pot of avidity which we can activate first turn we have a fusion substitute where we can activate first turn if we really felt like it we can do it first turn um because what we can do is we can use vion and uh wait what does this say so we can go into both actually we can't oh wow we're playing against the same exact deck okay well that's pretty good we got to be careful of our part of the bit oh no no not the dark law oh, i'm not ready for dark law damn it it's a fucking dark law i can't beat that yeah let's just use it wow that is not what i expected okay well i can polymerization can't i no i can't because there's no d hero in my hand but it's all right um what i was saying was uh no oh he's playing he's probably playing the same deck i am mine what the fuck red box tv are you kidding me we're gonna check this man's that we're gonna check his deck out to see if he's playing my deck because uh storming Let's see. He, oh, wait. He might be playing my deck, you guys. So I don't think... Ooh, that's a plague. Still can't use it, right? All right. So let's summon this again. Let's see if this can get to going. And all right. So we did get that off. Now, what we can do is uh, we can send Shadow Mist. And I think that might be the best option to do is to send the young Shadow Mist. Search the um, young Mally. And we can definitely Palmerization and use the plague out of our hand leave oh yeah we're definitely going to do that we're going to go you right then we're going to i guess stack the uh shadow mist yeah we're going to stack the shadow mist and then we're going to go ahead and go into a crow or dragon right and then we can use crow or dragon to discard and pop this we can do that and i think that's what we're going to do here but first, let's go ahead and do that because we can use Fusion Substitute. Yeah, we can. All right. So what we can do here, um, we do have this pot of avidity. So we could discard this Fusion Substitute to pop this, right? Then we could uh, we could um, go into um, a Beatrice to send. And I think that's what we're going to do here. We can go into a Beatrice to send. Um, oh, that's the beginning. Oh, never mind. He's not playing my deck. All right. So. Oh, we can go actually a, a, a Patana look, a, 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 a M7. Have I, did I use Vion's effect? Oh, okay. no, I did not. There, there, once you see, that's what I'm talking about. I keep fucking up. I keep forgetting Vion's effect. So what we can do here is um, we can go into a, what do you do? We can go, I think Beatrice is just the best option. Uh, Yeah, let's just go Beatrice here, folks. Let's just go Beatrice. Beatrice is clearly the best option. We're going to do this. We're going to discard the Mally. We're, we're going to do a Send a Celestial for next turn. Use this last Mally. Technically, not my last Mally. But we're going to use the last Mally. We're going to go in the right 
clear into a Tozogan. And hopefully we draw a spell and trap. And we don't. We do not draw a spell and trap. But you know what? It's okay. Because we're going to use this to put back one, two, and three. I almost put back his Mally. That would have been terrible. Draw a spell and trap. Yay. So we have draw a spell and trap. But what we fucked up, you know where I fucked up? Is I forgot to use Vion's effect. And if I use if I use Master of Vion's effect, we would have had um, the Draco E quest stuff. But I can I'm an idiot, so it doesn't really matter. We're gonna just deal with it accordingly. So we're gonna just go ahead and get rid of this, and then we're going to go ahead and attack you. So as you see, I clearly fucked up. I completely I I continued. I did that already. Already did that like two times before. I keep forgetting Vion's effect. And it, it, it hurts so badly, but you know what? It is okay. We can use you to go ahead and send, uh, I guess, Shadow Mist. And then we're going to search another Vion. Possibly not. Uh, not. Not that I think about it. It's, I don't think I should send Vion. Actually, we can. No, wait, what? Do I? I mean, it's a free search. Now let's send Plague. Let's just send Plague. There's no reason not to. It'll be all right. We'll be good. The Red Box TV. He's playing some other deck. I guess he's playing like a Diamond Dude Turbo deck because he is running this card. Um, Dark Griffer. Yeah, he, he's pretty. He's pretty. He's playing that deck. That's fine. Oh, you drew the third Mally. That is, that's awful. I'm I'm sorry, sir. Well, he's probably going to get Shadow Mist, and he's. I hope he's not playing Bubble Man, because then it doesn't. Okay, doesn't really work with the deck. Oh, excuse me, but. Like we could have sent Shadow Mist. That might have been the better play. Yeah, that, that might have that might have completely been the better play. So what we're going to do here is just we're going to use this young Mally first. We're gonna get all this out. We're gonna get all this out. Um uh, what do we I think do we wanna go void here? Um hmm, he only has 15, 49 left. So, I mean, I guess going Omega is cool, but Void is, you know, we're going to go Omega, but Void is clearly the card that we definitely want to do. What you can do is do this, use the second Mally, stack for Plague, um, bam, use this young uh, Celestial. Can we use Celestial? Wait a minute. Do we even have another target? No, we don't. So we would have completely banished our what's name, and then we would have been in trouble. Um, going to go to this young Omega. Is he going to quit? Is the Red Box TV going to quit? I think he's quitting. No, he's staying alive. Thank God. Thank God. He's, he's staying alive. We're going to use these two to get a free draw. Then we're going to use the young fusion substitute to put back the deadly guy, which is just oh, it's just so awesome. Oh, let's use this pot of desires. Let's get some more. Oh my Jesus, we drew into a soul charge now. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's just that's just amazing. That's what the deck was meant to do. I once again I fucked up on the Vion, but hopefully we can correct it. Let me pay more attention. Alright, here we go against Joey Jojo. And we have went rock and scissors. We're gonna go scissors again and we have won. Hopefully we open up a good hand. Oh, this is a it's an okay hand. Okay hand. Hopefully we don't balance two Mallies. We'll be all right if we don't. And we have drawn a Mally, so I'm guessing that we already banished another one. No, we literally got one Vion left in our deck. And most of our draw cards are pretty much banished. D-draw. Let's get a D-draw. Nope. That is that was probably the worst draw. This is this is going to end up bad, folks. But you know what? We do have a Twin Twister. We do have a Storming. And we have a Dimensional Barrier, which are three powerful cards that can easily easily keep us in the game you know what we don't even need the what's the name all right so we have drawn that but you know what it's okay because we do have this pot of avidity so all we need any any dark effect monster even mally itself and we can get out of this situation but that's fine uh mally all right vion that is possibly the best draw i could have had don't need to do that we can do you all right so now we can get back into this game Failer, you, you 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 sack of fucking potatoes, you punk bitch. But it's okay. Once again, like I said, all we needed was any effect monster. We would have been all right. Any dark effect monster. Since we only play darks, that really didn't matter. So what we can do is do use the young Mally and then do this. And then what we can go into now is uh, Beatrice. I believe Beatrice. Or we can go Vion. That's, I mean, we can add the Vion back with Constellar. With the Constellar card, 
but would that be the best option? That is that is what I'm trying to figure out. Um, I could send a D hero with this, but that's not what I want to do. Wait, do I even have another plague left? I do have one more plague left, so I can go Beatrice. I think Beatrice may be just the best option right now. And you know what? I think I know what I'm going to do here. So we're going to go Beatrice. And what we're going to do is we're going to send. And we're going to dump the um, young man known as Plague. And we're going to sacrifice our pot of avidity here. Um, we do. We still do have another one. So what we're going to do is we're going to um, use this Mally first because we don't want to get we don't want to get rid of the pot of avidity. But you know what? We got to put something back to the top. And you know what? We can go Omega right here, and then like we can just start getting Celestial going back in the grave. So hopefully we can actually draw another pot of avidity. And hopefully this man is not playing something of the of, of, of there's still weird type of decks. Where it just fucks you over. And let's see. It is Super Harry Samurai's. Okay, if this card is sent to the graveyard, top five cards in your deck. And then if I declare in a direct attack, and you can add a Super Harry Samurai to your fucking hand. Because that's just good. So this Dimensional Barrier is not going to do too much. Or this Storming Mirror Force is not going to do anything at all. Probably shouldn't attack me. It's probably a Giant Rat. It's actually the same exact card. So it's no point to really activate it because it's the same shit. But hey, people do weird stuff. So with that being said, we're going to go ahead and end our turn. And we're going to use this Omega to put back a Celestial. Because um, just because the Plague is already known, we can always put it back any other time. We want to put back this Celestial because we do want to get some, uh, some drawing going. So hopefully we're not forced to. Okay, well, all right, that's fine. That's fine with me. Um, that's completely fine. We did, once again, we're not going to use this Beatrice unless we're forced. What do you do? All right. So that it doesn't really do anything. So we can't really get upset at that. Um, what do you do? Uh, target one. Okay. And fix Pearson. Okay. Well, let's say this card can attack what faced up. All right. It's only 1800, right? That's only 1800. Don't don't need to. What do you do? If you have no, you could change this from defense. If you do add a super Aerie samurai soul, what is that? Monster from your deck to your hand. Okay, so I don't. What does this one do? You could target it. Um. Well, wait. While this card is equipped to a monster by this effect, monster your opponent has. Can I attack monsters you control? Okay. Okay. Well, he's. I, I think he might be going for the, the the second effect, which tributes and special summons a card out of his hand. No, that's the same card, isn't it? And this sent to the field to the give it, you can add one. That is just not. It's not once per turn either. So that's uh, completely all fine with me, everybody. So once he tributes, I'm just going to warning it. I think that might be just the best way to get rid of this. Um, yeah. Uh. You contribute a monster you control equipped with this card by this card's effects by summoning Superman inside right from your deck. And why can't I warning? Is something is something missing? Why can't I warning? Okay. Okay, well, I don't if anybody can explain to me why I can't warning, because it clearly says special oh well, I can just warning this effect, correct? Um, right? You could target, yeah, see, that's an effect. Oh, wait, it has to have a level, so it doesn't, I don't, okay. So I'm just going to warning the summon. Wait, if it's an effect, I have to warning the actual card. What do you do? They, they're just, okay. Oh, wait, wait, no. Fuck. Fuck, no. I could have dimensional barrier and stopped everything. Yes, let's go. Yes, that's dimensional barrier and call Singro. And then that's the end of that. I think it still sends because I don't know if it's like Spectral Sword. Yeah, it still sends. Okay, so it's like Spectral Sword. It still sends. Like I said, we're going to keep this pot of video at the top of our deck at all costs. Um, the other one, I guess, summons it. It pops spells and traps. I believe it does. Um, it, it's as far as I can remember because, yes, yeah, this one is pop spells and traps, correct? Yeah, after this card is summoned, you could destroy a. Yeah, see? Wait, what? 
You could destroy one of your, then you could set the destroyed. Okay, so that may be bad. That may be real bad, you guys. But you know what? I think I'm just going to have to let them. I'm going to have to let them do it. Because I don't want... I mean, hopefully he doesn't get the Twin Twister. Hopefully he hits something like Storming, or I hope he doesn't hit the Warning. But if he has any of these two, so he pretty much has a 33% um, chance to hitting this Twin Twister, which I don't want him to hit. I want him to hit either one of these cards, which will be fine with me. But, wait, what? After this, oh, see, you son of a bitch. See, cards, I don't get it. Konami, you make no sense. Um, What do you do? If you're trying to two or more monsters, you can spell some of this card from your hand. Holy fuck. That would have been good. But he already synchroed, so that's okay with me. Um, but yeah, I couldn't let that if I if I didn't dimensional barrier, I couldn't I wouldn't be able to warning the um the summon off the butter ball because it's through an effect. So that means it's like a formula. Like you can't you can't respond to formula synchro summon. Like if you use the effect of formula to synchro summon. It's through an effect, so it's like pretty much using Monster Reborn. You can't solemn warning the said card when it comes out. You have to, you know, do it right then and there. You have to negate the effect or something. So, Joey Jojo is still contemplating what he wants to do. I hope he didn't quit. I hope he didn't lose connection because this is a pretty good game. As you can see, I, like I told you guys, I'm holding on to that wasn't it. I'm holding on to it. Um, if we can keep, if we can draw into our pot of avidity, oh, time limit is up. Joey, Jojo, why? Why, Joey, Jojo? Man, almost, almost there to use the Draco request play. I could have did it in uh, the earlier duel, but I completely can fuck that one up. But we can possibly do it with this depending on what we draw here. Vion. All right, Allure. So we could set all this. You know what? Let's, let's cupidity. Let's cupidity. Desires, I mean. I know it's a Mally Banished. There has to be. No Mally Banished. Wow, that is pretty decent. Um, Let's allure. Well, that sucks. Um, Yeah, this doesn't... We can't do anything with this hand. Uh, Yeah, we're just going to have to wait. There's this pretty much the same exact hand, except for this was not a dimensional barrier. Um, it's a very bad hand. And this is why I kind of don't like desires because we don't play monsters as it is. And damn, look at that. Like we're down to down to only a couple of monsters. So I don't know if I want this abductor to resolve since he only playing nine in his extra deck. I believe it's nine. Is it nine? Yeah, it's nine extra deck cards. So I kind of don't want him to resolve it. But now since he completed scale, I'm just going to strike his summon. And I don't understand why you're setting. I don't understand trust bus and uh yeah Dwayne McFadden did suggest dynamis so definitely after we get done with these we'll be playing some dynamis uh just you know like he said go out of your comfort lane and that's what I'm going to do even though I hate these goddamn cards like I hate fluffles and I was supposed to play fluffles so I'm definitely going to get to that too I hate fluffles I hate damn dynamis because they always got they, they, their effect always does something um well you know what he already knows that I have a strike so we're going to do strike right now and then we can just end phase through this to get rid of these two. Because Donald Miss Rush is a good card. And we have opened up this this absolute ass. And there's nothing we can do about this. Just have to set another strike. There's nothing we can do. There's nothing we can do right now. This is just we gotta trust bust. But this is as I'm talking about with desires. It's just so look at that. Look at look at this completed scale. But look at that, man. One what is that? One that's four, five, six. That's six monsters that got banished off of what's the name? Well, I don't care about that. I'm just going to Storming Mirror Force. You know what? No, we're going to take that. We're going to take that because we can always use Storming Mirror Force. We're definitely going to take it. Hopefully, we can do something now. Draw a monster. Nope, Regeki. That's fine with me. We're going to use it. Well, did he just set that the first fucking turn? Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, I was about to fucking say. How the fuck was that? Two hundred two hundred fucking defense. It's two thousand defense. Okay, well that this strike is going to be a lot meaningful. Yeah, we're going to strike the shit out of this one. Let well, me put them two in the graveyard. Um, we we need we just need a monster. You son of a bitch. We need a monster. We need a damn monster. We're not going to use anything. We just need one monster, man. We need one monster. We can just get out of this. There we go. That's. Oh man, this deck just loves me. That's what this deck does. It just loves me. It loves me. It loves me so bad. 
So what we're going to do here is send Shadow Mist, and Shadow Mist is going to search uh, Celestial, and then we're going to use um, Vion to banish. Um, it doesn't really matter what we banished. We're going to banish Shadow Mist. We're going to search Polymerization, which I could have easily, you know, just did a different way. We're going to use you, Special Summon you. We're going to Polymerization these two. We're going to go ahead and go into another destiny guy, put the celestial in the grave. Um, we're going to go right into a Beatrice because Beatrice is a fantastic card. We're going to use young Beatrice, discarding that, not discarding, but putting the plague in the grave. Um, using the young pot of avidity, putting these three right back on the end of the deck. Drawing into a twin twister, which is amazing. What does this one say? Would it be destroy? And then this was the targeting one, right? So I can definitely do that. But yeah, you know what? We're going to do that next turn. We're going to go ahead and just lose the soul charge because it does nothing for the deck. Um, we're going to use Mali. And we're going to uh, continue our plays. We're going to go into a Cyframe Lord Omega because he only has one card in his hand. So you guys know what that pretty much means. We can go ahead and get we can get a lot of stuff going. Hopefully he doesn't protect it because that'll kind of be a bad thing for him to do. That's fine with him. Um, and you know what? We we we're going to go ahead and just we're going to hold off. We're going to hold off. We're going to use uh we're going to use Omega to go ahead and put back the banish the face down plague. And then we're going to use this to go ahead and detach and go ahead and send a shadow mist shadow mist is going to activate we're going to get our vion out of the out of the what's the name and then we probably should have twin twisted right then and there that's what i should have did but i didn't have a chance to so that sucks he can possibly go into what's the name and proceed to beat me but i want everybody to know that in my heart all right in my heart, I had I, I was going I was supposed to twin twister, right? And then once he would have he would had to place a scale, and then once he places a scale, Omega rips it out of his hand. He only has a five and a four. Can't possibly do anything that he runs straight into a storming. And we pretend I mean we proceed to win. But it looks like Trust Bust may be in a, a good position to come back and straight beat me if he plays utopia but he only playing nine extra deck cards and maybe utopia is not one of them all right so there he goes he's completely and utterly just completely through the game just now um because that was just awful that was just an awful thing for you to do you you, you definitely don't do that you, you pendulum summon you get your pendulum summon out that's just that's why would you do and then he negates he like it, if I didn't Omega, he wouldn't have been able to use the skill. So that sucks. He has to end his turn. But trust bus, it's all right. You're going to be okay, man. Everybody loses at a time. Um, let's go ahead and use. Uh, oh, I could have just definitely just did that. Um, let's go ahead and banish the drill guy. Oh, polymerization. We can use Rhoda for what? Oh, it's another shadow mist. Um, hmm. Can we go Draco Quest now? I can go, I can stack. No, we can't. Uh, oh, well, we can. I could stack this. We, we don't play another, we don't have another Vion, do we? One, two. I think the third one's banished. Yeah, the third one's banished. So, we can't do it. But, what can we do? A dragon and a Warrior. We can definitely get a Dragon and a Warrior out. You know what? That's what we want to do here. This is special something, right? We're going to get it. No, we can't, huh? No, we can't. I don't know what I'm thinking of. Um, Well, let's just go to Zoken and let's see what we get here. Uh, Let's go ahead and Rhoda. Oh, we can do that for sure. We can definitely do that one. Um, We can go ahead and just normal. We can go ahead and stack for plague. Right? Then we can go into a coral, not use uh, what's the name's effect. You, oh damn it, I messed up. Well, it doesn't matter. We we still have the victory here. Um, now should we? Oh, we we can't. Oh, let's go Postumbial. 
Let's go up a thunder hill. Let's go up a thunder hill. What do you, you guys know what I'm talking about? We're, we're going to put Uh We no, we're going to return a graveyard monster to the hand. We haven't normal. We have normal summoned, so we can add back the young Mally. So we're going to just use D draw because that's just fun to do. And we've drawn another polymerization. That is just awesome. So here we go. We can attack this. Oh, maybe he can protect. He can actually protect it, huh? Yes, he can. There you go. He stays alive. Actually stays alive. That's crazy. No, he doesn't. He just chooses not to protect himself. All right. Well, that is it for today, everybody. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. We did not be able to do the Draco Equest play, Equisit, whatever you want to call it. But we did not. We were, we were not able to do that. But we were able to show off the power of the deck, which is still good. So hopefully next, you know, next video we do be able to do the combo. Like I said, I could have did it if I remembered Vion second effect. But when I get to duel and I get so excited and I see so many plays and it's just so fun and I just I just forget. But we will not forget next time. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in tomorrow. Wait, wait, no, because I don't know what I might be up. No, I might be uploading this one on Friday or Monday. I do not know. Um, but I will see you guys um, the, the next time I upload after this video.